I'll give everyone a minute to take their seats and take the opportunity to introduce Professor Li Ling at the Institute of Taoism and Religious Culture at Sichuan University. Without further ado, Professor Li Ling. Okay, um, thank you. Can you hear me? Okay, so my, my topic is about um, uh, Parama uh, Dutisan or Buddhist Dutisan focus on the Shamajataka uh, images. Uh, it is very uh, unique image in uh, Dazu rock, uh, rock cave. Uh, this is my uh, focus on the image. Uh, in the middle one uh, is a uh, uh, Brahma son, a duty son. He's shoulder his parents. Um, um, from this, uh, from here, um, uh, there are inscriptions that this duty son is a um, Brahma son. Um, not the Buddhist side. And uh, another two pictures, and uh, this uh, come from Indian, South of Indian. Uh, this is uh, a, a Lama festival, Lama Yenna, Lama festival. Uh, uh, a young people, um, shoulder and his parents look like similar to this, uh, uh, the image. And uh, another uh, drawing come from Ajanta Kale. Uh, this be belong to the Buddhist, uh, Buddhist uh, context uh, is a uh, shama jataka, and in Dazu uh, rock cave, the uh, sh uh, the shama jataka, uh, the image showing like this. Uh, here is uh, their uh, parents and uh, hold uh, shama's body, and here is the king, and this is Yinda. So this picture is not a typical images. Uh, uh, about uh, the text uh, of uh, images of a uh, shama, we can now uh, uh, almost uh, uh, about seven, uh, seven, uh, eight piece in Chinese uh, Buddhist uh, Buddhist text. Um, so we can see this uh, story got so uh, spirit sp uh, spirit. Um, that's why the uh, Shama story uh, look as the fairly petty story, a fairly petty text of uh, Tripitaka. Um, we uh, we can uh, we can notice that some uh, detail about uh, uh, a, Shama, a Shama story uh, reference to the images. Uh, the first uh, is that uh, Shama. Uh, taking the water uh, from the pool, and uh, another another word is uh, before uh, Shama died, uh, he said, uh, "I'm don't afraid to to be die, but I'm worried about my blind parents." And later on, uh, the king uh, told his parents that uh, Shama will be die. Then his parents crying to the heaven, and the uh, the the finally. Uh, the Yindala or the, the heaven king come uh, down uh, from the heaven and uh, light his parents and the Shama uh, revived. Uh, revived. Uh, at the end of the story, uh, Buddha uh, told Ananda that Shama is me. That is the story. So uh, from um, the uh, the image, image, image tradition, we can notice that there are uh, uh, two uh, types of sh uh, shama. One types, uh, one types is what uh, brings them. This uh, take water style is very uh, uh, earlier. We can be, we can find uh, this, uh, this image come from Sanchi. Uh, belong to the um, first century BC or second century BC. So we can find the Shama take the water. And uh, they also, uh, we also can find in Gandhala art uh, also the same, the same style. Um, uh, Shama take the water here and uh, take the water here. And also Kizir in China, uh, 
the story also showing that uh, the type the typical uh, style, the shaman take the water from the pool, and also can be found uh, six uh, six uh, piece uh, at least six piece in Dunhuang Cave. And then this is a uh, cave uh, number twenty uh, two nine nine, uh, belong to the sixth century. This is the Shama uh, Jataka uh, Shama Jataka story, and uh, this is the Shama image. He uh, take the water here, and then this another cave also showing uh, Shama take the water, and also have more uh, exam uh, examples. Uh, in Kazari, Magician, and uh, another place. All this type uh, belong to the water fetching or take water. Another uh, type is a Shodian Paris. This is not popular. Which, um, up to now, um, I only found one example from Ajanta Kill. This painting for, uh, belong to the 5th century, um, but only one. So the question are coming that uh, the image of Shama um, uh, on Baoding Shan Yin Da Zhu, why the uh, the 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 shouting, uh, sh shoulder and parents image uh, look as uh, white dog means non Buddhism. So uh, we uh, I will mention the two uh, Buddhist uh, text. Why is uh, Shama Jataka? This uh, story comes from India. Another uh, sutra is uh, mm, uh, come from China. Means Bao Jing. The story, uh, the story, uh, story from the introduction of this uh, sutra. This uh, the image, yeah, the image uh, um, about uh, 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 Shama have two types. One is the uh, fetching water. Mm. Another is uh, shouting his parents. Um, the question is, is that why in the uh, agenda, uh, the shouting parents, the image belong to the Buddhist, but uh, in Dazu changed uh, Brahma son, uh, means uh, non Buddhist. I will show Dazu rock caves. Uh, my topic, uh, the image uh, is here in the shrine number number seven, seventeen. It's here. We can uh, we can find uh, in the middle is uh, uh, the Buddha, and uh, there are so many images. Uh, from here is the beginning of the uh, the story. We can find Ananda here. And here is uh, uh, Bao Enjing, uh, uh, Bao en uh, in, in introduction of Bao, Bao Enjing. And uh, in, uh, there are uh, so many uh, stories of uh, Shakyamuni uh, showing here. One of them is, is uh, Shama Jata, Jataka. Um, but Da uh, Zhu, uh, Rock Kill, Showing a non typical image of Shama. Look, uh, look like this. And uh, the, sh the shoulder of his parents' image is uh, 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 Brahman's son from this inscription. Uh, this is uh, Bao Enjing uh, recorded that. Uh, the important, the key was that uh, the the dutiful, the dutiful son just take his uh, mother. His important uh, words, it just uh, hold his mother, take his mother on the shoulder. Uh, I will show uh, show you some uh, picture from Dunhuang. We can see the dutiful son carrying his mother, not uh, parents, not father, mother and father. And uh, this another example. He's uh, shouting his mother like this. It is Ananda. And uh, the same images. Well, we can compare it with that. This is the uh, Dunhuang uh, Q number 10. Uh, 
uh, this is the Plaman son uh, carrying his uh, um, old mother. But uh, this also, uh, we look at uh, the Plaman son, but his uh, shoulder, his parents, not only old mother, so they are different. Then um, the question is coming that where the image come from? When, um, we usually uh, know that uh, the Chinese monk uh, take the uh, Indian sutra um, by the copy. So uh, actually the image also used the same way. Uh, then the change happened in this processing. So we can compile this uh, different uh, three images. This is the Brahman's, uh, Brahman sun, and uh, this is a Buddhist uh, beautiful sun. And uh, this come from a Bo Enjing uh, story. So up to now, I give a, a, a small summary that uh, from the Shama Jataka, we can know that there are two types uh, of Shama. Um, one is uh, um, uh, one is uh, the taking waters type. Another is uh, showing his parent, uh, his parents, and from this uh, uh, um, from this pi uh, picture, we can now the north of China, you uh, mainly uh, get uh, the first 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 types. And uh, in, the, in the south of China, only found in Dazhou, uh, get the second type. So one more question is coming. How the image reached to Dazhou means uh, reached to south of, southwest of China. Uh, I, I will show you some uh, Buddhist art, uh, Buddhist art style. We can we can compile some uh, different uh, art cell. Uh, look at the uh, face, uh, uh, Chinese face. And uh, this is the, also that those images. Uh, it uh, look like Chinese people. And uh, this is the Indian uh, sculpture. And uh, this come from Cambodia. We can compare; they are look like similar. So, um, uh, because of this, I will go back the background of uh, uh, cultural exchange in southwest of China. The I will mention that, uh, especially mention that the Chola Dynasty uh, of south of India, south of India. Um, Chola uh, Dynasty. Uh, get the strong and the big power about ten around the tenth century. Mm. In that time, they uh, occupied the um, big area and also uh, get relationship with China or Song Dynasty. In that time, uh, Jula, uh, Chola period, uh, the main religion is a uh, Hinduism. In that time, and the um, two texts. Um, Mahaprabha and uh, Lama Yenna is very very popular. We know that uh, the Shama Jataka actually come from Lama Yenna. So from uh, uh, from ten uh, about uh, ten century, uh, the Shama Jataka from Lama Yana is uh, get popular, and the, the image look like this is also get popular. We can find this uh, from Indian south of India, uh, Shama shouldering, shouldering his parents' uh, uh, sculpture found in the uh, Hinduism temple, and uh, this story also popular in in south of India and uh, in um, Sri Lanka and uh, uh, Thailand and some, some uh, uh, Buddhist country. Um, 
many many young people and the children know that story. And uh, in 1984, also held this uh, uh, film. And the TV program also uh, showing this story. Um, this picture uh, is around 10th century from Happy. And uh, this is uh, joined by me from Indian. It's a new new painting, and uh, 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 come to the uh, Muslim period, uh, the the miniatures painting also uh, um, popular this uh, stories. We can say this uh, this uh, parents here. Parents here, and there's another painting. And the, uh, in the uh, Lama Yena story, uh, Lama Yena festival, uh, uh, Lama festival is very popular in south of India. And in um, Brahmanic text, we know that the Lama uh, summer story is very, very popular. And uh, the, this beautiful son of uh, um, Plumman, his image is uh, uh, usually showing, showing that uh, take his parents on the shoulder. And in this festival, not only the, the doubt people uh, performance this uh, story, they also teaching the children should be a dutiful son. So we can see this just a baby take a toy parents like this. So because of the context changed, we can now at the beginning, the uh, text and the image belong to the Buddhist tradition. But from 10th century, around 10th century, this story reach to China again, but this time the background already already changed. From that time, the people now, this story come from Ramayana. This story uh, refers to uh, um, Hinduism or Brahmanism. When this uh, story uh, from uh, through uh, Sri Lanka or Cambodia, reach to uh, Yunnan of China, also um, be written in a local language, how Chinese uh, version about Ramayana, the Yunnan language called Laga uh, Xigong, the same Ramayana story. So uh, that's why uh, in Da Zhu, uh, rock kill showing the uh, Shama Jataka use uh, not typical images. Um, the shoulder, uh, shoulder and parents image become a uh, Brahman uh, dutiful son, not uh, Buddhist son anymore. And uh, again, another clue that um, from Fashian recorded that when he uh, stayed in Sri Lanka uh, around 5th century, he, he, he met their uh, Buddhist festival. And there are many Buddhist drama was uh, performance. One of them is uh, Shamajataka. Uh, even if nowadays in Sri Lanka, uh, this story is still uh, very popular, but uh, if in Buddhist context, the Shama take the water, but uh, if in uh, Brahman text, that uh, Shama shouldering his parents, so it's a clear different. This talent, uh, this ta uh, come from talent uh, picture, this come from India. Mm, images. So summary of all that uh, the mm, uh, Shama Jataka, the text have two uh, 
have two texts. One is come from Buddhist text. Another is come from Prama is uh, means uh, recorded in Lamayana. And the image have two two types. One is take the water. Another is shouting parents. Um, but the shouting parents uh, of the uh, Buddhist image is not popular, just found in Ajanta Kale. When this uh, image get popular, uh, it's uh, changed his uh, text already belong to the um, Brahmanism. Uh, so that's why the teaching uh, take waters, uh, um, the Shama, look as the Buddhist tradition. Uh, take his parents on the shoulder, look as the Hinduism and means non-Buddhist. <laughs> Thank you all. Um, I hope I can uh, speak clear, but uh, uh, okay. Thank you. Thank you all. Thank you so much, Professor Li Ling, for a fascinating presentation.